YouTube, and today I have an unboxing of the Diane Pyramid. <laughs> So in this video I'm unboxing the Dion Pyraminx and I got this from the cubicle and I really can't wait to get into this because as many of you know I love Pyraminx and this package is really easy to open. Okay. So I have Gens 357 stickers in here which look pretty nice. So I don't really know what these shades are even called but this is what I ordered. I think it's Fulbright's, pretty sure. So, I'll probably be restickering my Gans 357 with that. And this is the Dion Pyraminx, and I got it in stickerless, as you can maybe see through there. So, it says Dion Pyraminx 1. That's kind of cool. Maybe they'll make more. Um, not really anything interesting on the box. 4-axis, 1-rank, tetrahedron, magic cube. <laughs> so, I what I've seen of this on, on the interwebs is that... Um, it appears to pop a little bit, but hopefully that's not too big of a problem. So, these shades aren't too bad. The blue is kind of dark, but it's okay. So, first turns. Um, it seems... It's actually... It has a really weird feel. Um, I've never tried a stickerless Pyraminx before. I'm not sure if it has anything to do with that, but... It's, like, kind of clicky, but... It feels like it might be a little locky. I hope that's not... I hope that goes away with breaking in. But, I don't know. It doesn't seem like it's going to pop. But I will look at the mechanism. Oh, yeah. This actually seems like it, it might be able to pop. I don't know. But, yeah. Pretty basic Pyraminx mechanism. What we've all seen before. So, um, in case you did not know, Pyraminx is my favorite event. So, I was really excited about this. Hopefully it can be good enough to be my main, especially now that stickerless cubes are legal. That would be really nice. So I'm just going to do a quick solve on here. I'm going to use my stack mat timer. So let's see how I do. That was a really bad solve, 6.21, but it's kind of awkward with the tripod around here, so... <laughs> but... This actually is kind of getting better the more the more I turn it and stuff. It's actually pretty nice. So that's really all there is to say about this. There's not much to go over. Tips turn well. Everything seems pretty good. Let's hope this becomes my main. My Moyu is really nice right now, but it's actually locking a little bit, but it's a little bit faster in general. Seems like that's all about there is to say in this video. I'll definitely have a review on this coming out shortly, probably early July or so would be my guess. But yeah, I'm going to play around with this a lot, do a lot of solves, break it in, lube it, tension it. Um, that'll be really awesome. Let's hope. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on my next video.